was a Christmas party thrown in Downing Street for dozens of people on December the 18th. What I can tell the right honourable gentleman is that uh, is that all guidance was followed uh, completely during number 10. And can I, and, and can I, can I recommend uh, to the right honourable gentleman that he does uh, the same uh, with his own Christmas party, which he's advertised uh, for December the 15th, for which, to which unaccountably he's failed to invite the, 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 the deputy leader, uh, Mr Speaker. <laughs> Nice try, but that won't work, Mr. Speaker. The, the, the defence seems to be the defence seems to be no rules were broken. Well, I've got the rules that were in place at the time, Prime Minister of this party. They're very they're very clear, Mr. Speaker. You you must you must not have a work Christmas lunch or party. Does the Prime Minister really expect the country to believe that while people were banned from seeing their loved ones at Christmas last year, it was fine for him and his friends to throw a boozy party in Downing Street? Prime Minister. Uh, Mr Speaker, I've said said what I've said about uh, number 10 and uh, uh, the events of of 12 months ago, uh, but since he asked about what we're asking the the country to do this year, Mr Speaker, which I think is, uh, frankly, a a more relevant uh, consideration. Uh, 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 The the important thing to do, Mr Speaker, is not only to follow the guidance which we have uh, which we have set out, but also when it comes to dealing with the Omicron uh, variant, to make sure that, as we've said, that you wear a mask in, uh, on public transport and in, uh, in, in shops, Mr Speaker, and that you self-isolate if you come into contact uh, with, somebody, uh, with somebody who has uh, Omicron, Mr Speaker. And above all, what we're doing is strengthening our measures at the borders, uh, but particularly, and I think this will be uh, very valuable for everybody to hear, uh, get your booster, Mr yeah. Speaker. Uh, I, know that, I know the right honourable gentleman uh, is eligible uh, for his booster. I'm not going to ask him, Mr Speaker, since I'm forbidden to ask him uh, questions, uh, but I hope very much uh, that he's had it. Well, I can tell the Prime Minister I've had mine. Keir Starmer. Mr Speaker, the Prime Minister says uh, we should concentrate on what he's asking the country to do. We're asking the country to follow the rules. Yep. Now, the Prime, Minister, the Prime Minister doesn't deny there was a Downing Street Christmas party last year. He's not denied it. He says, he says no rules were broken. Both of those things can't be true, Prime Minister. He's taking the British public for fools. And as for following the rules, Prime Minister, it might be good just to look behind you when it comes to the question of masks. As ever, one rule for them, another rule for everybody else.